Hello, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the 1996 Action Man Paraglider. So let's take a closer look and see what I actually came with. So here we have the paraglider. It is about 50 centimetres in length, um, so it's quite big. I might struggle to get it all on camera, but I'll do my best. And um, what I'm going to do first is show you this feature on the back so that I can take the Action Man off. There is actually an orange button here, and the idea is Action Man's supposed to swoop down, and then you press this button and then his legs are supposed to come out so that he can uh, land basically so I'll try and get it on camera you press the button and it's quite tough there we go and he swings and basically that's so that he can land um, I will take him off because it will make it a little bit easier for the review ok let's take a close look at the controls as you can see here there is an additional handle on the side and um, that does rotate but it's at that angle so that you can put the action men that don't have articulated arms um, on there as well so that they can still use the paraglider otherwise they'd only be holding with one arm and probably would fall off quite a lot um, it is a loose piece so just be careful if you're buying on the secondary market because that can come off and can be missing um, we have like these little ski bits here there is supposed to be a sticker on both sides unfortunately I've lost the sticker for this then we have a control panel just in there as you can see lots of stickers more stickers over here, it's stickers galore on this thing to be honest and then we spin it round, I will try and get a better view he has a control panel in here and then a, uh, can I get the keyboard, can I get the keyboard, no but there is like a keyboard sticker just about there that you can't quite make out uh, he does hold it nicely, Once uh, either action man will hold it, either style and then we have this leg grip here, that's just what holds his legs and you press the button um, and it doesn't seem to open up mine unless it's got weight on it so obviously it's got the action man legs then you press the button then it'll open but if you just press the button itself it doesn't actually open that regularly there's another sticker on the back I don't know if that's supposed to be a handle um, but it doesn't this is definitely the handle um, so I'm not too sure what this tails for just to add a little bit more detail I believe so I'll show you the underneath this is the stick, uh, the button that you press to activate it and then if we spin it round the other side we have this contraption here so this lifts up on this, on my one I'm not sure whether some of the clips are a little bit broken but it doesn't stay on very well um, whether they've been bent, it doesn't look like they've been broken they've just probably bent or worn over time so it doesn't stay on very well unfortunately then we have these two buttons here to fire this style of projectile um, one of the springs has gone in mine, I need to take it apart and have a quick jig with it so you press the button and one fires out and then you're supposed to press the boot or the button and it fires out again unfortunately mine doesn't then we have this hook on the top here uh, and also included on this there's a little metal um, bar and what that's for is so that you can slide the paraglider down on a piece of string um, with trying to minimize excuse me the rope burn uh, that you'd get through the plastic I have lost many action men over the years to friction with string and cotton and rope so that's a nice addition that they've included that and thought about it rather than it just burning through on one swing down uh, it doesn't glide I'll tell you that we have tried this we took it out up in the hills a couple of weeks ago and I thought oh, I'll just give it a throw uh, and it nose dived so be very careful with these wings because this plastic is kind of brittle so I'll go on to the wings now anyway we have some nicely moulded Action Man logos on here a little bit more detail, some ridges here that are also moulded plenty of stickers again all the way along another one here, you flip it round you do get another Action Man sticker on the bottom and then also you get these end pieces these are generally missing quite a lot I, for years I kept finding these in bulks of Action Men slots that I was buying and I was like what is that from and I couldn't place it but now I finally know and I think I've got about 6 spare um, but yeah, they go in, they do pop out quite easily. I've actually super glued mine in just because I didn't want it to keep losing it in the collection. So they are now held in. The wings can pop out sometimes, they just pop out and pop in. Um, but just be careful. And they, like I say, the plastic can get a little bit brittle. So um, just be careful with that. I was quite lucky that when I threw it, it didn't break. So that was the Action Man 1996 Paraglider. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time for more Roll Pain Reviews. Whoosh.